and the thing is, though, I mean, we all should really, really care because, I mean, we call each other brother because it, it's it's supposed to be a family, a fraternity, you know. And, you know, well after the fact that, you know, one of us is gone, you know, the, the rest the rest of us need to, 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 to take care of one another. Um, you know, we, we don't have unions. We don't have pensions. We, we don't we don't have anything like that. You know, um, you know. People people get on me because some kind sometimes guys don't get paid all of their money, or sometimes guys with no guarantees get very little money. The fact of the matter is, you know, you can ask anybody that's ever worked for me when we've had good houses, of whether they've gotten bonuses and things things like that. Uh, they have. Anytime anybody's been short of any money, it's because it's just not there. I'm the guy that that did the most with the least, you know. But uh, you know, in this time frame, I'm out of money. You know, and I'm not ashamed to admit it. You know, uh, the, the 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 well has ran dry, and uh, you know, and if, if people can't accept that, they can't accept that. But you know, um, any guy that comes to wrestle for IWA, you know, in the future and goes, oh, I didn't get all my money. You know, is he is should he really be that shocked? You know, I mean, you know, if you take the booking, you know, there's there's a possibility. You know, um, I'm, not, I'm not. I'm not saying that's right or wrong. I'm not saying that's right or wrong. I'm. I'm just saying, you know, you, 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 really, hey, you really can't, you know, be all that pissed at me. <laughs> yeah, do you want to play, play some play your craft and and learn and maybe only get half your money or whatever, or do you want to just say, well, piss on IWA, they're not even there, and now I get no money. You know, I, I've always hey, listen, been for the bigger picture. Ian, 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 Ian. <laughs> This is this is something, and I don't, you know, you can fucking take it for what it's worth from a fucking awesome, completely cool, fucking rock and roll super stud and his buddy, uh, Violence Jack. This is the kind of, IWA is sort of the kind of thing that we've been looking at to, like, take over and make fucking cool and profitable for a long time. But we're probably going to do our own thing to make it cool and profitable in the future, but... You know what I mean? Like, it, it, are you that hard to work with? Like, uh, I, I saw this thing that you're Hitler to work with. Like, Violet Jack and I, Violet, Violet Jack and I have to be Paul Heyman plus. Like, we got to be in control plus. You know what I mean? Are you that bad to work for? Like you say, like, 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 say Ian, Ian you say, hey, Violet Jack and fucking Sensei, we need. I, I'd love you to take over. And make this the coolest thing. I want you to get me on iPay per view with Go Fight Live. I know you guys are with Go Fight Live as it is right now. I need you to go with Go Fight Live. We need the tournament, of the, the King of the Death Matches. I need the double, double fucking uh, tag team death matches. I need fucking Ted Petty Invitational on, on pay per view. You guys make this happen for me. Are you that much of a Hitler that you couldn't say, "Hey, Violence Jack and fucking Sensei, boom, do it. Let me take care of fucking rocking." You know what I mean? Are first, you that bad of a all, guy? First of all, if if I was if, if I was that much of a Hitler, we would we wouldn't have one of the problems we do have in IWA, which is you know uh, I book somebody and then you know they call me up and go you know hey Ian I got an offer for a better deal on that day and you know uh, I I really need to take this can you let me out of this booking you know <laughs> I, I I wouldn't be that guy and goes yeah sure go ahead you know um, you know the the the, the thing is. Uh, uh, about that, you know, is uh, every employee that goes away fr- from a company uh, is going to go away disgruntled. If you stay there the entire time, you know, uh, you, you don't hear you don't hear the Undertaker shitting on Vince because he's been there for 20 years. You know, so he's obviously happy, or at least happy enough that he doesn't 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 shit on 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 the company. You know. Uh, in, in wrestling, you have so many egos and everything to deal with that you can't. It's, it's impossible to keep everybody happy, you know. But you uh, know, but, if, but 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 let me let me ask you this, Ian. If you let's say, just say, if you had some uh, steel-fisted scumbag motherfuckers like Mayor Van this Jack come in and just take over on creative and be like, hey, you're doing this or you're out. You're gonna be the coolest fucking guy character of all times. So you're out. So you think that? I mean, that would fucking make. I mean, your smart mark videos would go up. You, you'd have a chance on i on uh, i pay per view because I mean, IWA Mid South has the coolest. I mean, like one of the top between. Okay, you got Chikara, which doesn't draw fucking anybody except on fucking DVD sales. 
and CZW, they draw, well, and they get really good. That's not really true. I've, 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 heard, I've heard Mike. Wait, wait a minute. Let's back up a second. Uh, you know, Chikara, Chikara, you know, they have their spots here and there, you know, but Mike puts on a, a fantastic family friendly product, you know, and, and, and for some of his bigger shows, I mean, he draws well. I've, I've heard crowds this year of like almost 800 people, and on the Indies, that's, that's exceptional. You know, okay, I mean, well, this is this is from somebody that just sees the DVDs, and I'm looking at like 20 people. You know what I mean? It's like, okay, here's Fire Ant and Soldier Ant, and there's 20 people in the crowd. It's not that cool. But you know what? What I mean, because from what me and Father Jack do, we draw a fucking boom, shit tons of motherfuckers, put them all in front of the camera, and don't let anybody fucking take a shit backwards on the deal. That's you know what I'm saying. It's like you, you gotta you know that's a whole that's a whole fucking thing. Yeah, and I don't want to get into it with you. I don't want to argue about your car. Fuck you. We're talking about IWM in South, for fuck's sake. And I want to bring in Mr. California because this guy, I know you got something to say to him. He's got something to say to you. I, I don't know if it's good or if it's bad, if you're going to fight each other or if you're going to team up with each other against CCW. What's up, Mr. California? Ian Rodden, brother. Undisputed king of hardcore. Hey, I hear that name everywhere, brother. Ian Rodden, I wrestled every guy. And mid south, every guy in the East Coast, I beat in a lot of them. Some beat me. So, uh, you know what? I, I hear your name everywhere, brother. So, I mean, how about you get your ass in a plane? Like around January, brother, you come bring your ass down because I know you wrestled Supreme and you fucking lost to him. That was kind of fucking pitiful. But uh, how, about you get in the ring with, how about you get in the ring with me, old man, and I'll show you how we dance out here in the West Coast, and I'm going to make you bleed one more time. Wait like, a minute. Did you just call me an old man? I called you an old man. I called you an old man. That's what I called you, old man. I respect what you've done. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. I will forget more about this business than you will ever learn. You, you, you can think that you can call me an old man, but you got to remember, I was earning my hardcore badge of honor when you were still shitting in, in your diapers and sucking on your mommy's titty. So you think that you're going to get by calling me an old man. That's just going to get you a worse ass whipping. <laughs> so you're, well, you're probably right. You're, up, it? you're probably right, old man. But when you bring your ass down to California, if you if you accept my challenge, because I'm challenging you, if you accept my challenge, you bring you bring your old time ass over here in your wheelchair, because that's why I'm gonna put you in a wheelchair, and I'm gonna send you back to fucking wherever the fuck you're from. You know what I'm saying? Because I mean, you're the undisputed king of hardcore. I think that's the the last trophy I need, so I become the undisputed ultra violent king out here in the West Coast, brother. Because Supreme ain't doing it no more, you know what I mean? No, it, it doesn't matter whether it's ultraviolet or hardcore. You probably don't even know what the definition of hardcore is. You know, you, you think, uh, you know, you're going to get out there and, and, and you're going to call yourself Mr. California and, and, and all that stuff. I don't even know if that's that great a moniker anyway. I mean, what's so great about the, the state of California? You, you're broke, your government's writing checks for IOUs. You know, I mean, uh, you got worse credit than I do out there, and that's a whole entire state. You know, <laughs> you know you 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 think that you're gonna put me in a in a wheelchair, you know, dude. You name what you want to do, when you want to do it, and uh, uh, I I'll be there. You know, just uh, you know, make make sure uh, you know, my plane lands around 420 for some of that good uh California Kush. Uh, you talk to the wrong guy, brother, because I'm straight edge, brother. But uh, but uh, you can have Amos buy you that shit because yeah, the last I guy who was straight edge was a real asshole too. Was that being punk? Was that being punk? Yeah. Another angry ah. motherfucker. Yeah, the best being punk. I paid $100 to put him in the ring with Ray Mysterio Jr. and Eddie Guerrero. Airplane tickets and hotel. Now, was it? Being grateful, little bastard. <laughs> hey, you know what, Ian? Hold on, hold on, Sensei. Let me tell this guy something. Maybe you know what? Maybe maybe that's maybe that's a, wait a minute. Maybe that's the whole kid's problem. Maybe you need to do. Maybe, maybe... Maybe you need to get with Governor Schwarzenegger before he gets out of office, learn how to speak no. proper English, and then, Ooh. you know, get you some, some of that good California weed and, you know, straighten yourself out a little bit because, dude, the world of pain that's coming to you is going to be brutal. <laughs> Look at, you hear that? That's a, he said brutal. He said, he's going to hurt me. He ain't going to hurt me, old man. Break, like, he's going like to break picture, you down. Hey, like, hey, hey, like the feet show did, I'm going to take the other eye out, brother, because the feature took one of your eyes. I'm going to take the other one out. I'm going to take the other eye out, old man. You know what I'm saying? Because you're an old-timer. You can't even move no more. what happened until after that. 
Oh, I don't know. I mean, I've got this issue all the time. See, all right, see, you see, boys. Mr. California, okay. I'm going to explain something to you. Listen to me, son. I'm going to explain something to you. This old man is going to come to California, and I'm going to beat your ass seven ways from Sunday. And when I'm done doing that, I'm going to fuck your wife in the ass dry. <laughs> 